everyone welcome back to our youtube channel so today we will be discussing a very interesting topic that is some last minute tips before you give your upsc civil service examinations i know these are very very basic and random tips that i'm you know going to give you guys but at times what happens is in life we tend to even ignore the smallest of things because of course it's such a big exam and people literally you know devote their 2 to 3 years of their lives towards this particular exam so it's very common and it's also very obvious to leave out some of the most basic things that i think you all know but it's just like a recap it's just like a revision that you all might just need before you go and achieve what you want to so very basic tips again as i said this video is going to be a very light video there is no rocket science going on there is no uh, you know hectic uh, strategy uh, that i'm going to tell you this is something that you already must be knowing but it's just that at times it happens right that we need someone to tell the same things again in a more simplified manner so that we can you know implement that in our lives so first and the most foremost thing that i want you to do now is that you do not get mangled up with the kind of resources that you have i'm pretty sure um whatever preparation you've done that is for the best right just do not open your books again and start you know thoroughly reading it because of course you won't be able to finish it in one day which is again obvious so just go through whatever short notes that you must have made throughout the year right just go through them thoroughly and that's it that should be you know your go to material basically that should be your go to material to revise because the, right now if you try to you know incorporate some something new then what will happen is that you'll just get confused and we don't want that at the last moment right so do not read anything new just revise whatever you've learned right and then you're good to go the second tip would be that when you see the question paper do not just rush to answer just because everyone in the exam hall has started writing you do not need to do that okay read the questions carefully so a lot of times what happens in the upsc exam is that people do know what they're doing but they do not read the question paper carefully and what happens is that they misinterpret the question so first and foremost thing is that you need to understand what the question wants you to answer right just reading the headline and just is getting some keywords and writing a long perfect answer out of it is not going to help you crack the exam so spend your time spend a good amount of time in reading the questions thoroughly and also analyzing them as to what exactly does it need you to answer right so just do not get hassled with the way everyone has started writing and maybe you know time is going out that that is the reason you had done mock tests right that is the reason you've prepared throughout the year so i don't think time management should be a particular you know task for you right now so understand the question and then answer and also a lot of students miss out on this that they do not they're not able to you know uh, keep a check between a balance basically between speed and accuracy so both are extremely important it just does not matter if you if you complete your paper even maybe 2 hours or 1 hour before the designated time and you do not attempt the all the questions and you do not you know give the right answers then what is the use of completing the question paper so fast right so you need to have this balance between speed and accuracy that is the reason time management comes into play here it's of crucial importance that you manage your time while writing the answers and also check as to how much time you're taking for each question right so that's the reason you need to balance basically accuracy and speed because accurate answers with speed will help you grow uh again this is need not to needless to say i would rather uh would like to say that do not forget your important documents because when you're under stress when you're under a lot of pressure it's highly likely that you might forget one or two things so in advance prepare all the documents locate your center where you have to go beforehand because this is something extremely important and you might just miss out right so this was it from my side i would say and stay tuned for such educational content and also i would like to give a huge thumbs up to all the aspirants out there do your best and you know that you've done your best it's just that you have to you know shine through the world and pass with flying colors a uh, huge all the best for everyone who's attending the exam thank you so much and also 
Stay tuned for such more content and subscribe, like and share. Thank you.